There is some major economic news coming out this week that you need to know about, and this is going to affect everybody. And no, I'm not talking about the September FOMC meeting. This news is so important, it could make the September FOMC meeting look like a walk in the park. And this news affects everybody. It affects long-term investors, swing traders, day traders. It even affects people who are not in the market. And this is what you need to know. Before the FOMC meeting on Wednesday, there's another piece of economic news coming out on Tuesday that, in my mind, is going to have a far bigger impact on the market than Jerome Powell will on Wednesday. And that news is the U.S. retail sales for August. And look at this. Two months ago, it came in at 1% growth. But look at the prediction for last month in August negative 0.3%. And this is massive. If retail sales actually come in at negative 0.3%, we are talking about a decline in consumer spending. And if we're getting a decline in consumer spending, guys, that is one of the most telltale signs of a recession that we could possibly get. Meaning, if the data comes out like it's expected to, it really doesn't matter what Jerome Powell says, the economy is in a recession. And that alone could spook investors and it could trigger a massive sell-off. Now, just thinking about psychology here, more than likely investors are gonna be a little bit teamed in their selling and they're going to be waiting for Jerome Powell. But if we get a bearish Jerome Powell who comes out and says, look, I'm really concerned about the economy, and that is combined with an economic slowdown in consumer spending and retail sales, and we're combining that with now two months in a row of bad jobs data and rising unemployment, we're talking about an overall picture where there is no other alternative explanation other than a recession happening right now. And if that's the case, we could expect a pretty significant sell-off in the market starting this week and continuing for many months to come. So watch out for this economic news coming out on Tuesday. Obviously, the September FOMC meeting is really important, but this retail sales data on Tuesday could actually be even more important. And yes, you see, I've got my son Jackson here. Uh, unfortunately, my wife is out at a conference and Jackson isn't really feeling well. So he's hanging out with daddy right now. Uh, Jackson, say hi to everybody. Say hi. There you go. And uh, yeah, we're just having some great daddy son time. Um, I do want to apologize to everybody. On Saturday, I held a live training and my deepest apologies. I did not realize that the webinar was going to be limited to 100 people. Uh, it's a brand new software. I've never used it before. I wasn't really sure how it worked. And I found out later that only 100 people could get in. And I got inundated with emails saying, what's going on? It says the room is full. It says there's only 100 people. I can't get in. Sadly, the vast majority of people who signed up were not able to get into the webinar. So I want to make it up for you. And again, my deepest apologies. So anybody who tried to get in but wasn't able to get in, I'm going to go ahead and do the webinar again. It's going to be the exact same material that I covered on Saturday. I'm just going to do it again in here in about two weeks. So if you want to get into the training in two weeks, I'm going to open it up to a lot more than 100 people this time. I don't know what the limit is, maybe 500 or 1,000, but we'll make sure we get everybody in there. All you have to do is go register for that at the first link in the description below. And unfortunately, if you did register for the last one, you are going to have to uh, register again for this next one. And by the way, if you did attend that live training, just let me know in the comments below what you thought of it. Uh, it seemed to go really well. People seem to get a lot out of it. Uh, but let me know in the comments below what you actually thought of it. And uh, again, my deepest apologies, but we'll make it up to you. We'll do it again on the 28th at 3 p.m. Eastern time. Just register using the first link in the description below.